U.S. fighter jet pilots detail alleged UFO sightings and near-miss interaction. Fighter jet pilots from the United States have reported encountering strange, unidentified flying objects while operating their aircraft midair. Experienced Lieutenants Ryan Graves and Danny Acoin, as well as three other anonymous squadron pilots, who fly Fahrenheit per hour-18 Super Hornet jets told the New York Times they first noticed the objects in 2014. Lieutenant Graves and Lieutenant Acoin were part of the VFA-11 at Ripper's squadron at the time of the alleged incidents. 190,528 U.S. fighter jet pilots Air Force UFO sightings News World fighter jet pilots from the United States have reported encountering strange unidentified flying objects while operating their aircraft midair. U.S. Department of Defense In vision of one incident recorded by Lt. Graves' squadron while performing training maneuvers between Virginia and Florida off the Theodore Roosevelt aircraft carrier, the silhouette of a strangely elongated object was caught in one of the jet's cameras. The pilots recorded the shapes flying over the ocean at high speed, suddenly stopping and rotating midair. These things would be out there all day, Lt. Graves told the New York Times. Yopal have seen strange stuff on military aircraft for decades. E.E. doing this very complex mission, to go from 30,000 feet, diving down. It would be a pretty big deal to have something up there. 190,528 U.S. fighter jet pilots Air Force UFO Sightings News World. Lt. Graves and his team reported the sightings to the U.S. Department of Defense Advanced Aerospace Threat Identification Program run from the Pentagon. However they were only ever described as striking series of incidents. The alleged sightings were said to occur around a height of up to 9100 meters in the air and included such close interactions as two pilots saying the LMOST hit one of those things. Those incidents led to the pilots questioning whether the objects were part of a classified U.S. government drone program unbeknown to military personnel. The Pentagon program was shut down in 2012. However new rules for fighter pilots to report alleged sightings were put in place following the incidents connected to the Roosevelt carrier that allows the recounts of military personnel to not be dismissed as illusion. The Theodore Roosevelt carrier left the U.S., deployed to the Persian Gulf in 2015 to form part of the fight against Islamic State. The pilots have since said the alleged sightings have stopped since their departure.